Differences between a lion and a tiger. Lions and tigers are two of the most confused animals for a lot of people. The most common reason for this is because of how many similarities they share. At first glance, lions and tigers can seem the same, especially the females. The most striking difference between the males is the mane, which is absent on the tigers. However, they differ in more ways as well. But before we look at the differences, if you're new here, welcome. Be sure to subscribe and why not turn on the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of our new videos. What is a lion and a tiger? Lion, which is generally referred to as the king of the forest, is also a symbol of power and royalty. It is a wild animal with pale yellow skin, a short rounded head, round ears, fairy tufts, and a deep chested muscular body. Its colors are white, pale yellow, ochre, deep orange brown, and ash brown. The total lifespan of a lion is about 10 to 14 years, and the scientific name of the lion is Pantera Leo. A tiger, on the other hand, is also a wild animal with a muscular body, robust forelimbs, yellow irises, the stout teeth wearing the crown of the national animal of India, Bangladesh, Malaysia, and South Korea. It is identified by its orange brown fur, having dark vertical stripes in it. Tigers exist in three different colors golden, white, and stripy snow white. The lifespan of a tiger is between 10 to 15 years, and the scientific name of a tiger is Pantera tigris. Now that we all know what and how a lion and a tiger looks, let's now look at the differences. Differences in size Tigers are the largest felons in the world and can reach up to 12.5 feet in length, including the tail and up to 650 pounds. On the other hand, lions tend to weigh between 350 to 550 kilos and measure a little over 6.5 and 11 feet. Interestingly, lions have longer tails than tigers, that is, a lion is taller but a tiger is larger and has more muscular and stronger physique than a lion. A tiger also has 25% bigger brain than a lion. Differences in color Lion has short light tan, yellowish brown, reddish or ochre colored fur and tan, dark brown or black mane around the face and only the males have manes. While a tiger on the other hand has orange fur on the black and lateral sides of the body and white fur on the belly, its body is covered with around 100 black stripes that provide camouflage in the jungles. In terms of habitats, lions come from Africa whereas tigers are native to Asia. However, until relatively recently, lions habitats used to include a large part of Eurasia from Greece to India. In fact, there is still a subspecies of lions called the Asiatic lion, which is also known as the Persian or Indian lion, in the Gur forest in western India. It is in severe danger of extinction. So, a lion lives in the large grasslands and open plains of the African savanna, from the east of the continent to Senegal and from south of the Sahara to South Africa, except for the jungles of the Congo. A tiger on its part lives from Siberia to southern eastern Asia, including India and the island of Sumatra. They are also found in grasslands and swampy margins. They require sufficient cover, a good population of large prey, and a constant water supply. Speed A lion can reach speeds of up to 50 miles per hour, but it can travel only for so long at this speed. While on the other hand, a tiger can reach a speed of 30 to 40 and 37 on average miles per hour, and it is generally considered more agile and more active than a lion. Lions and Tigers as Hunters Both lions and tigers are nocturnal hunters. Lions live in groups called prides, made of few females, one or two adult males and their offspring. Females lionesses are responsible for hunting and providing a food. They usually hunt and eat Thompson's gazelles, impala, zebra, wildebeest, cape buffalo, giraffe, hippo and rhino. Lions also frequently steal food from cheetahs, hyenas and wild dogs. Most females hunt to get at night to make it harder on the prey to see them, but they will sometimes hunt in the daytime. They have three important hunting strategies that vary based on the prey, the ambush, the bleeds and the siege. Wild tigers are solitary creatures that live and hunt on their own. Deer, buffalo, wild pigs, monkeys, fish and birds are usually on their menu. Unlike the lions, tigers never steal food from other animals. Aside from being more active, tigers are also more aggressive than lions during hunting. Social activity. Lions are the most socially inclined of all wild felines, most of which remain quite solitary in nature. Some lions are residents living in groups of related lionesses, their mates and offsprings. Membership only changes within birth and death of the lions. An average pride can consist of five to six females. They are cubs and one or two males. 
Some can be nomads, not belonging to any parks. While the young female tigers on their part establish their first territories close to their mothers, the overlap between females and the mother's territories reduce with time. Males, however, migrate further than the female counterparts and set out at a young age to mark out their own area. Tigers are not territorial and prefer to avoid each other. Reproduction Tigers and lions have very similar reproductive characteristics, given that both reach sexual maturity at between 2 to 4 years of age. Lions, after a gestation period of 100 to 110 days, the pregnant female leaves the pride and finds a place to deliver. Depending on the physical characteristics of the habitat, lions will hide their newborn cubs in marshes or copses. The number of cubs born depends on the age and dietary condition of the mother. The latest size is 1 to 6 offspring. Cubs are nursed 6 to 7 months and they reach sexual maturity of 24 to 28 months in captivity and at 36 to 46 months in the wild. If a pride is taken over by a new male who has defeated the top resident male, he will mostly likely kill any existing cubs that are under 2 years old. On the other hand, a female tiger will give birth to 2 to 4 cubs after a gestation of 104 days. They will stay with their mother for up to 2 years before leaving to stake out their own territories. Males look for territories away from their birth site, but females may sometimes share their mother's territories. As with lions, male tigers may kill the female's cubs if the cubs are the offsprings of another male. This ensures that the female will come into oysters and bear the new male's offspring. Their lifespan Lions live for approximately 12 to 18 years, but while in captivity, they can live for over 24 years. The lifespan of tigers in the wild is thought to be about 10 to 12 years. Tigers in zoos live up to 25 years or more, but not by much. Conclusion Like every other living thing, wild animals also come with two different shades. They are no doubt dangerous to human beings, but at the same time, they also teach us some of the life lessons. Have you ever seen a depressed lion? Or a lion who has given up on things? No, right? A lot of times, lions do not succeed at hunting, but they never give up and keep trying till they don't achieve what they want. Apart from these, lions and tigers teach us bravery, determination, teamwork, patience and loyalty. Moreover, if you observe these graceful creatures in action, you will learn to live in the moment. Live like a king as lions and remain strong like a tiger. There you have it. Now those were some of the differences between a lion and a tiger. But if you have any more, drop in the comment section below. And if you enjoyed watching, please subscribe to our channel and don't forget to share it with your friends.